Hey guys, it's Tixie here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another Black Ops Cold War best class setup video. And today, guys, we're looking at one of the best guns in the game, the Tech 9. So I've got a mixture of gameplays for you today using this weapon. And at the end of the video, guys, I will go through the class setup for anybody who's interested. So enjoy the rest of the gameplay and I'll catch you all at the end of the video. Diffused. Bomb is armed.
Damage detected. against us. So, bomb planted. Hold your positions. Spy plane in the turn. We have eyes on. Alright guys, so I'll just run through the Tech 9 class setup that I was using. Um, so firstly for the muzzle, I run the fully auto repeater. Now you do lose a bit of damage on this, you do lose effective damage range and the horizontal recoil control, but you do get more fire rate. Now this is probably the one attachment that I think is probably personal preference. I would say personally that I think the burst fire repeater seems a little bit better, but I just like to go with the security with the fully auto repeater that you can miss a couple of shots and still usually win the gunfight where with the burst fire repeater you've got to be a lot more accurate so that one's kind of down to personal preference but I run the fully auto repeater for the barrel I run, run the task force to gain back some of that damage that we lost um, and effective damage range and you get 75% on your bullet velocity you do get some recoil control problems with this um, attachment but we do gain that back in the under barrel with field agent grip vertical recoil control of 6% and horizontal recoil control of 20% again you do lose quite a bit of shoot and move speed um, for the magazine I run the 33 round fast mag um, again for maximum ammo reload quickness again you do lose some ADS speed this is just kind of how I've always built my class ups guys um, you do lose a little bit of speed and then with the handle you gain some of the ADS speed back flinch resistance aim while going prone but again you lose some more shoot and move speed and more sprint to fire speed so I think again guys it is very much down to personal preference I think the Tech 9 is an unbelievable weapon it's not my favourite SMG in the game but it's definitely still one of the most competitive guns and like I say I've always kind of built my class up from Cold War like this do lose a little bit of speed but I think it's just because I trust my reaction time and kind of trust my movement that I don't need to be maxed out on speed but yeah try this out guys and let me know how it gets on you can always change a few things around if you think it's slowed down a bit too much but yeah if you did enjoy today's video guys please do hit the like button down below if you are brand new around here and want to find your way back for more please do consider subscribing to the channel and as always i hope everyone has an amazing day and i'll catch you in the next one